Cardiovascular disease remains the number one killer in the United States. A new computed tomography scanner is at Auctioner's Health System, and this advanced imaging tool will help physicians diagnose and pinpoint heart attacks and strokes. Computed tomography has been around for years, and just a few years back, the gold standard in this technology was the 16-slice CT scanner. Now, the state-of-the-art multi-slice technology is the 64-slice CT scanner, and it's making a big difference for auctioner physicians when it comes to taking pictures of the heart and arteries. Unlike an angiogram, the CT scanning procedure is non-invasive. Well, the risk of an, an angiogram is uh, relatively low, but the possible complications are significant. Bleeding is the most important thing we worry about. Uh, rarely people may need blood transfusions or a procedure to stop the bleeding. The 64 slice scanner is a completely non-invasive procedure. We place an IV in the vein and so there's no significant risk of bleeding. You'll, you'll need a band-aid after the procedure. But there's no significant bleeding problems and because we're not entering the body there's no increased risk of stroke or death from the procedure. And so we can get this CT scan and take a look at these pulmonary veins and tell our electrophysiologists how big they are. The 64 slice is so fast and accurate it has the ability to image the heart while it's beating, precisely producing diagnostic pictures within five to ten seconds. Each time the computer, the x-ray equipment is spinning around the body it's collecting 64 slices of data each time. The analogy is when you're trying to take pictures of your kids or your dog and they're running around and every time you look at the picture and it's blurry, 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 maybe one picture is good. Uh, the f a flash can help stop that action or for photographers, faster shutter speed or faster film is able to stop that action. That's sort of what we're doing with 64 slice data by trying to capture more of that information each sweep around, we can try and freeze the motion of the heart. The entire procedure takes about 20 minutes, and once the CT scan is complete, the patient can leave the hospital. Dr. Riley says while the invasive angiogram can show physicians where there are blockages in the artery of the heart, the blockage is only seen after there is quite a bit of plaque buildup. 64 slice CT scan, because it, because it doesn't just look at just the artery because it's showing us the whole heart and in fact showing us the walls of the artery itself, we can see the very beginnings of plaque maybe even before it would show up on invasive angiogram. Besides the benefit of early intervention with cardio patients, you can see there's not any narrowings here uh, of this artery here. Dr. Riley says this multi-slice imaging device can also accurately indicate when a patient is out of danger. The real strength of the cardiac CT the multi-slice CT scan of the heart is in predicting who is normal, in tell telling us who's normal. We call that the negative predictive value. Meaning, if this test is negative, this test says that you're normal, that you don't have type blockages of the heart, we can be about 98% confident that that's true. To learn more about cardiac CT, contact Dr. John Riley at 504-842-3786.